Hi you guys, this is the nail art we're going to be working on today. Um, it's a marble effect. That's the first thing we're going to start with, the marble effect. So you guys got to start um, by polishing your nail black. Or you guys can choose any two other colors you guys would like, but I chose black and white. So let's get started. What I'm going to do to my um, thumb, I'm already wearing my hydrating base coat. Um, and I polished one coat of black. It's all you need, the one coat of black. Next I'm going to get my white polish and I'm going to do a swervy white side swipe, a swervy one. So let's get started with that. So I'm just going to side swipe it in a swervy style starting from this corner and I'm going to just swerve it, swerve it and um, it's okay that there's a little bit of black showing because that really isn't going to matter when it comes to this nail art we're, we'll be doing, it doesn't really matter. So now that we've done the side swerves, you guys can see that the black shows a little bit, but that's okay. There's nothing wrong with that. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to get our white again, and you're going to put your black next to the white. And what we're going to do is we're going to dot equal amounts of dots on our white part of our nail. So we're going to glop white drops sporadically here and there because this is what we're going to use to make the marbling effect. Just dots. You guys can see the dots. Just dots here and there. Make sure they're not too thin so they won't dry out too quickly. Now we're going to get the black and we're going to do the same thing. We're going to place black dots here and there. Now what we're going to do, we're going to get our toothpick and we're going to do swerves on this area, on the areas. Not straight lines, um, swerves. Swerves like that. Because this is going to be what creates the marbling effect. Just the swerves. And there you have it. That's how you create the marbling effect. Now that we've created the marbling effect, the next thing we gotta do is we're gonna get a glitter, a glitter polish like our nail art polishes with, with the thin, with the thin brush, and we're gonna outline the swerves we made. We're just gonna outline them like that. So let's outline the side swerve we made. See right there. So that's all we did. We outlined we outlined the swerve, the white swerve we made. Next thing we're going to do, and this step is um, optional, is I'm going to use a white glitter shimmer. And I'm not sure if it can be captured on the camera, but I on the marbleized area, I added shimmer. And it's easier to see it in person. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to add shimmer, a little bit of shimmer just here and there on the marbleized area. Not too much, just a little. Okay. Now that I've done that, the next step to do is, and this one's also optional, you could leave your nail like that and that's already a really cute look, but I'm going to add a clear rhinestone where you see there on the black part. So I'm going to glop the area where I'm going to want the rhinestone right there. So I'm going to dip my toothpick in the polish. I'm going to Take my rhinestone and I'm going to place it right there. So all I'll have to do next is wait for it to dry and reapply a glop of polish on top of the rhinestone and then um, don't forget your top coat. And that's how you guys get this look. It's a really easy to do look, but it looks complicated, but it really wasn't, as you guys could see. I hope you guys like this, you guys, and um, take care and try it out. All right? Bye-bye.